Good morning, Quadcopter 101. And what I got for you today is another uh, micro FPV racer from Ghoul RC. And this is the Ghoul RC G85. Now, the G85, um, I'm kind of excited to give it a try here. Um, it is available and for uh, almost ready to fly and in bind and fly for uh, Fly Sky and Free Sky and Radio Link. Unfortunately, as of now, they don't have DSM, uh, DSM2 version, DSMX version. Uh, hopefully someday in the near future they will get it. But uh, we have a 600 TVL camera. It's 40 channels, but what's neat about it is it's 200 milliwatt. So, you know, it's not your little rinky-dink 25 milliwatt FPV transmitter. Um, it also has a beeper, as you see here. And a F3 uh, PicoBlox uh, flight control board. Now, unfortunately, this does not have on-screen display, but again, we have the beeper to alert us if uh, we got low battery warning. Um, the Pico blocks. I've been seeing this. This is the second time I've seen one of these on an FPV transmitter. Uh, they're mic little micro FPV uh, flight control boards, F3 flight control boards, uh, but uh, they are made to be one of the smallest out there. Um, not the smallest. There are smaller than this, but uh, it is a good little uh, flight control board, at least in the other one that I flew. Um, it's loaded up with uh, uh, Pico Blocks 3.1.5 uh, that you can adjust on beta flight, which I did go into beta flight. A little minor tweaking of the uh, switches, that's about it. So we're going to fly it with the uh, uh, pit settings that come with it. So keep that in mind, folks. Uh, the motors on this are 1106 6000 kV motors. It has a 10 amp 4 in 1 ESCs on the power distribution board, built in the power distribution board. Um, 1935 five bladed props. So that should give us some oomph, <laughs> all that together there, uh, especially with this provided 3S battery. We got a 450 milliamp hour 3S battery to give us the oomph. So, I'm, again, I'm kind of excited to see this. The only thing I wish this had, and it doesn't come with it, is on-screen display. On-screen display would have top, you know, sent this over the top. Um, there is one thing I don't like about it, and, you know, this is for the, the bind and fly versions, is the way they mount the transmitter. If you look, there, or the receiver. There is the receiver for it. There's my Fly Sky receiver. Um, I just mounted it onto one of the arms here with sticky tape. <laughs> I hope that don't become a problem. I don't see that coming off, but I can see that restricting, <clears throat> excuse me, airflow through the propellers. So we'll see if that has any effect on flight control performance. So let's go for a flight of this thing and see how it performs. Hope you enjoy its flight. Okay, we're ready to go. Uh, to arm this thing, you bring these uh, throttle down and to the right, and that arms the quadcopter. And as you can see here, we do not have any uh, on-screen display. So we're going to be listening for the beeper to give us alert when we're low on battery. So arming it again, and let's take, well, wait a minute, make sure I'm in acro. We are in an acro now. Let's take to the air. Hope you enjoy this flight. Arming it again. It disarms itself rather quickly. Ooh, I had to, I had to give a little more oomph, or a little more power there to lift this battery than I normally would. Well, let's try it up and try that. Okay, went up again, trying our right roll, doesn't roll nicely. Let's go between the trees, go around the trees first. I'm not going through the center just yet. Well, yeah, I can feel it lifting that heavy battery. That battery's kind of big for it, folks. <laughs> Although it can do it. Uh, this probably would be better with it, maybe with a 2S. You know, people say, oh, put a 3S battery on and make it scream. It's not always true, folks. You know, because that adds up the weight. You want to keep the weight to a minimum here. But it's flying v v rather well. You know, even with a 3S battery. Oh, <laughs> and once you get it up to speed, it, it can go fast <laughs> with that 3S. If speed is your thing, you know, but if you want to fly like um, freestyle with it, you probably might want to go with a lower weight battery to give you more um, or um, more acceleration. You know, I'm going with acceleration with a three style battery, but or three S battery, but I think I could probably get a little bit higher acceleration with this with a, a lighter weight battery. Okay, let's try some slaloming through the trees. 
coming down. Whoa. I don't know what happened there. I had a little bit of a drop out. Okay, I don't know what happened there, folks. I, I had a little bit of drop out. Uh, maybe I lost the signal there. I was a little too far away and low. So I'm um, arming it again, staying in acro, and let's go back to the air. But again, we'll try slowing through the trees again. Coming around this way. I can hear that beeper beeping already. Yeah, and it's it's oh, that's juice. It. <laughs> it <laughs> that's it. Juice. Well, folks, well, the beeper stopped. I'm going to try one more time there, but I was giving it a lot of throttle there at the end. So I think that, you know, we are getting close to battery power, out, although I'm not hearing the beeper beeping. So let's give it one more shot and see how it performs. And actually, I'm going to fly this one line of sight for this last part. Okay, let's go to angle mode. And let's take it to the air. Let's see if it takes to the air. No, no, I'm giving it a lot of power. That's it. <laughs> there ain't, more, ain't no more throttle. No more power. So, this has potential. Um, this battery might be not be the best battery for it. <laughs> it doesn't seem to, you know, it's a 3S battery, but uh, it really wasn't uh, giving it a lot of oomph, the, t the amount of oomph that I, I would be expecting to see out of this. So uh, you might consider getting a replacement battery for this rather than the one that comes with it because it just didn't see to, seem to have the oomph that I normally see or would expect from this particular system. So that's the Google RC G85. Hope you enjoyed this flight. Squadcopter 101. Signing out.